future, nobody gets in that door. <laughs> Whether you like it or not. Please, Mum. I can't take another holiday at Auntie Prue's. <laughs> <laughs> Please, Auntie Prue, 500 star jumps before breakfast is too much. Nonsense. You need to earn your wheat jump porridge. Now, put your backs into it, spit spot. <laughs> <laughs> We're not going back to Auntie Prue's. We've managed to find a holiday camp you haven't been banned from. And there's loads of activities to keep you out of our hair. I, I mean, happy. Mm. Adventure playgrounds, archery targets, scavenger hunts, fun, fun, fun from dawn till dusk. <laughs> Sounds brilliant. Let's get packing, Nasha. Rest, rest, rest. Oh, look, son. <laughs> Dad, saves me taking it down. Are we there yet? For the five hundredth time, no. Uh, try and enjoy the country here. Insert pipe K. Into slot nine. <laughs> Taking care not to. <laughs> can I check out the campsite, Dad? Of course you can. Soon as you get your tent up. <laughs> That'll keep him quiet for a bit. <laughs> <laughs> All done. I'll be back for tea. See ya. <laughs> hey! Welcome to Camp Sunshine. I'm Billy, your crazy camp host. Okay, I'm looking for fun. Am I right? I'll show you the way and let you start relaxing. Oh. And here's our activity tent. Now, you don't want grown-ups cramping your style, am I right? So, I've left it all in the capable hands of my favourite nephew. Cool. <laughs> Walter! Yes! I see your mum got the leaflet. <laughs> she told me all about Auntie Prue's and I couldn't bear to think of you having another terrible time on your holidays. Yes! Right then, I'll leave you to get on with it then, shall I? <laughs> Bye-bye for now. Cool! Archery! <laughs> Felt it pens! So we can do some fun colouring in, of course. Colouring in? What about archery? Oh no, Dennis, that's far too dangerous. We're exploring the creative arts. Creative, eh? Stay within the lines. Hmm. Don't forget the uh... oh, no! <laughs> bullseye. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in charge here. Oh, if you want to stay, you have to go oh, to do what I tell you. Oh, maybe I don't want to stay. What? Would you rather go back to Auntie Prue's? <laughs> <laughs> Nothing like a bracing ice cold char. That's <laughs> okay. Maybe it is better here. Just yeah. Hmm. Of course it is. You'll find my activities a perfect blend of healthy exercise and educational fun. <laughs> to the adventure playground. <laughs> That's more like it. <sighs> This is not more like it. We should be climbing it, not cleaning it. And mess it up with your muddy feet. Not likely. <laughs> more water. We need more water. Whatever you say, Walter. <laughs> about it, you'll have to leave. And we both know what that means. Uh, can't I have some lemonade, Auntie?
Fancy? Nonsense. Prune juice is good for you. <laughs> ah, this holiday is turning into a real washout. <laughs> <Woo -hoo! laughs> oh, hello, son. Ready for some beans and sausages? Proper camping food. Hey, hey! Everyone's having a lovely time. <laughs> Am I right? Yes. Yes. Walter said you weren't settling in. He thought you may be happier on holiday somewhere else. Auntie Prue's, was it? Oh, oh behave! Oh, behave! behave. Oh, behave. Oh, behave. Tell you what, there's a scavenger hunt tomorrow. Yeah! Why don't you take part and see for yourselves that a Camp Sunshine holiday is the best holiday in the whole wide world. <laughs> Am I right? Oh, I love my job. <laughs> Dennis, please find a way to get along with Walter before he gets us all kicked out. And before we have to go and stay with Auntie Prue. Oh, well, it's going to be all right. Oh, I'm not letting Walter ruin our holiday. Time for Plan D and G. <laughs> Morning. I've made breakfast. Are you feeling all right? Of course. Why don't the two of you go for a nice early morning walk? I'll look after B. Like Dad says, proper camping food. Hope you're hungry, B. They're the best scavenger list ever. Those beans brewing yet, B? <laughs> now to print it out. Oh, what is that pong? <laughs> Keep watch, Nasha. <laughs> Let's make this list a bit more interesting. <laughs> Genius wears a striped jumper. Dash, dash. Now, where was I? Oh, yes. <laughs> Thanks, B. <laughs> now, the scaving hunt rules are simple. Like you, eh, Walter? <laughs> <laughs> Silence! Collect as many items on my list as you can. But beware, many of them are rather surprising. He's not wrong there. Nash, Nash! Uncle Billy and I will judge the winner when you get back. On your marks, get set, scavenge! <laughs> 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 Scavenger hunts, Walter. I put loads of fun items on this year. Uh, my megaphone! Hey, wh what are you doing with that? It was on Walter's list. Look. Let me see that. The, the red toilet roll, five points. Birthface cheek. Uh, a hot dog sausage, ten points. My dinner more like. A pair of polka dot pants, a hundred points. All the tent pegs you can carry, ten points each. <laughs> but I don't understand. <laughs> it's chaos back there. Who told you ought to pull up our tent pegs? <laughs> Sorry, Walter. It seems you can't be trusted to be in charge. Am I right? Yes! Hey, kids, who would you like in charge? Yes! I can't hear you! Yes! Well, looks like we have a winner. Am I right? Yes! Oh, I'm not wrong. Time for some proper fun. Colouring in the archery targets. Huh? Style. Hooray! Uh, hang on, Walter. Someone has some tent pegs to replace. Am I right? No. Oh, cheer up, Walter. We're on holiday. Am I right? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 
headmaster. No, oh, it wasn't me. <laughs> <laughs> Detention. <laughs> Sorry, but we just can't do this. Detention. Places to go, people to menace. Well, you should have thought of that earlier, shouldn't you, Dennis? Please, Mrs. Creature. It'll clear in a few hours. I promise I'll make it up to you. You'll make it up to me by writing a thousand times I will not make stink bombs ever again! Oh, this is bad. Really bad. Oh, what's wrong, Dennis? We've done loads of detentions. Yeah, and it's not that long a sentence. Yeah, but Mayor Scrimp's unveiling his new statue at five o'clock. <laughs> 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 Time for some menacing genius. I have to be there. 3.30. <gasps> Better get a Code 1 menace alert to Nasha to help spring us. <gasps> a Code 1? Trust me, it'll be worth it. Okay. Time for Plan B. What about the torturing teacher over there? This calls for a 40 wink blink think to get us out of the clink. And I know just the think. <laughs> I, I mean, thing. And the key for the ref is to make sure the last defender is in line. <laughs> Offside rule nap attack. Works every time. Real curly. Now, let's bust out of here, find Nasha, and leg it to the park. Another faulty ball. I must have a word with the manufacturers. OK. Plan C. Aha! The confiscation cupboard. Should be one or two useful things of mine in there. Yeah. Oh! 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 oh. <sighs> Phew! That was close. Ooh. Now! Who's good at tying knots? No, 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 Dudley. You've got it all wrong. It was Marla's Seventh Symphony that was in E minor. What the? Uh, well, well, well. I wonder what the headmaster would say if he saw this. Let's find out, shall we? Real plan, Dennis. Just enough time to get a quick bite of pie. No can do. We've got to get to the park before five. Um, <clears throat> Dennis. Sir, this is just the kind of irresponsible behaviour I've come to expect from these rapscallions. What? You snitch, Walter! Uh, what he means is we were just checking that the emergency escape routes are working, you know, in case of an emergency. Yeah, no, that all seems to be fine. Oh, please! You're not going to fall for that, are you, Headmaster? What? Oh, no, of course not. I wasn't born yesterday. Oh, of course you weren't. You're much, much, much older than that. Oh! Oh, oh, oh. It's better if I keep an eye on them from now on. I already know the offside rule. Are you sure, Headmaster? Yes, yes, don't worry. I've recruited a little extra help. Do it, men. I want those prisoners contained. Whatever it takes. He's been listening to too many of the Colonel's war stories. Walter's not the only one we have to get past. No worries. Headmaster, have you met Paul the Potato? Oh, 
thinks you are feeling very sleepy. Oh. Oh. oh, I see what you're doing. Well, you won't catch me. I mean... Well done, Pie Face. You too, Paul. Right, you thinking what I'm thinking? Oh, definitely. Brilliant, Dennis. Genius, yeah. No, sorry, no idea. It's finally time for Plan D. Cover me, men. I'm going in. Call that a water pistol. This is a water pistol. <laughs> okay, so they have the doors and the windows covered. But we haven't tried going down. I'm starving. By my calculations, we should be underneath the perimeter fence around the boat next Tuesday. Well, that's no good, Curly. Got to be there by five o'clock or we'll miss everything. <gasps> What's that noise? My stomach? Nope. I'd know that sound anywhere. <laughs> Brilliant, Nasha. I knew you'd get here. Eventually. Nash, nash. Nasser got in. <gasps> we can go out the same way. And that's plan D and G. We'll get to the park if we double quick crawl. Lead the way, pie face. Oh, sorry, Dennis. Must have been the pies at lunch. Oh, we'll have to make the tunnel a lot bigger. Nasher will sort it out. Fantastic! We'll be in the park in time. Ha! Keep it up, men. Those prisoners are slippery. Could pop up anywhere. Free at last. Not on my watch. <laughs> Like I said, uh, I'm not the kind of fool to let myself be hypnotized. Ah, sorry, Dennis. It's half past four. I think it's game over. Game what? Over. Pfft, no way! We're Team Menace. We never give up. Evening, ladies. Good night, young man. All right, remember our guard's motto. Be prepared for anything. Those prisoners could make a break for it at any moment. What are you still doing here, boys? Detention finished half an hour ago. What? Uh, do tell Walter he can go. Poor boy will be guarding you all night otherwise. <laughs> uh, about Walter? Oh, we'll let him know eventually. <laughs> Come on! And it gives me great pleasure to <laughs> my statue. I don't know much about art, Nasha, but I know what I like. Nash, Nash, Nana, Nash. Only a few more hours to go. <laughs> <laughs> uh, time to go to Plan L. Plan L? Leggings! <laughs>
Nasha's brilliant at keeping our treehouse a pest-free zone. Claudius! Claudius! Oops! Speaking of pests... <laughs> what have you done with Claudius? Your monkey Moggy attacked us. Only because your mouldy mud chased him up there. Out of my way, I'm coming in. Into our treehouse? No way. Just you try and stop me. Man the defences, menaces! from intruders. Result! <laughs> As if we let Walter or anyone into our treehouse. <laughs> Best den in the history of Beano Town. Best den in the history of the world. Oh, cool. Can I come and see it? <gasps> no, sorry. <laughs> no, not possible. Menace's only zone. No can do. Um, did you just say no to me? Uh, yep. Don't worry, Angel Face. I've seen their den. It's rubbish. My new den is far cooler than theirs. Really? What new den? Ta da! Perfecto! You're a genius, Walter! An evil genius! <laughs> You're too kind. Took me all night to design these ownership papers for the treehouse. Nobody will know they're fake. <laughs> Except me. <gasps> Angel Face, hand over that document. What's in it for me? You want to get into Dennis's treehouse, don't you? Well, I can help you if you help me. What do you need? <laughs> D and G, track Walter's den with our secret weapon. Nash! One menace that dog sled, ready to mush. Nasha, you know what to do. Nash! Nash! Once you'd finally caught up with me, I could take you to his new den. So, what are we waiting for? Of course, I'll have to blindfold you. Don't want to spoil the surprise. <laughs> oh, are we nearly there yet? I'm hungry. Oh, we're here, all right. 
to me. Go ask your dad. The treehouse does belong to Walter. <gasps> he came earlier and showed us the property deeds. The properly what? Ownership papers, usually kept in Mayor Scrimp's office. They say the tree and the treehouse belong to Walter's family. Walter owns the treehouse? That can't be right. I guess we'll need a new hideout. I know the perfect place. Pie face, sitting in your dad's old pie boxes in his pie shop is not the perfect place. Of course it is. Close to home, pies on tap. Perfect. Isn't that right, Paul? What do you mean, no? <laughs> miss, 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 miss. Uh, at least someone's happy. We are menaces, and we are not letting Walter take our treehouse. We're taking it back. Nash, this is the treehouse. Walter's the pepper pot, me, Nasha, Curly, Pie Face. We sneak in, dodge our own traps, and take back what's ours. <laughs> oh, tasty bomb, Daddy. <laughs> We've been expecting you, Dennis. Bring it on. Walter, look, I'll pop down to the town hall first thing in the morning and get you a copy. The town hall? No, well, I, um, I mean... You mean those papers of yours are fake? The treehouse never belonged to you, Walter. No, I mean, uh, no need. I've gone off this place. You can keep your stupid treehouse. <laughs> <laughs> The treehouse was way too easy to break into. We need an old mattress, a broken bicycle, and all the baked beans we can carry. In the morning, thank you. I've had enough excitement for one night. Walter, I'm coming in. Now! Old baked beans, Dennis! Woohoo! Woo it's good to be home. Nash! Nash!
Choo choo! Here comes the train bee! Good girl bee! Dennis, that's disgusting. Sit down and eat properly. No time, Mum. I I'm meeting Curly and Pieface at the fair. Oh, no, you're not. I need you to look after B while I'm at my relaxation class. Oh, Mum, can you take her with you? Well, that wouldn't be very relaxing, would it? Yeah, it'd be fine. B could chill out too, couldn't you, B? <coughs> See, she said yes. No more argument, Dennis. It won't hurt you to look after your little sister for a couple of hours. But, Mum, I want to go to the fair. Well, you'll just have to take her with you. <laughs> what do we doing first, Dennis? Coconut shy. Remember all the great stuff we won last year? <laughs> These balls are foam rubber. Oh, yes, uh, new regulations, see? We can't have kids like you winning everything. Uh, I mean, injuring yourselves. Never mind the coconuts. Let's have a go on the dodgems. Yeah, maybe we can beat the speed record we set up last year. Never mind fun, you just keep to the speed limit. <laughs> we could have walked faster than those dodgems. Don't worry, Pie Face, there are plenty more rides. We'll have a go on the big swing. Oh, yeah. Oh, now, son. Health and safety in it. More than my job's worth. Oh, I've had more fun in one of Mrs Creature's detentions. Yeah, it's almost like they don't want us to have a good time. Don't panic, boys. There's got to be something worth having a go on. <gasps> Bouncy Castle! Bouncy Castle! Hey, well spotted, B. We'll be all right now, boys. We always have a good time on the bouncy castle. <laughs> but, Dan, what if it's not as good as last year? Yeah, what if it's a totally non-bouncy castle? Nah, you can't mess around with a bouncy castle. It'll be great. Come on! All oh, right, you lot. Hold it right there. What's up? We only want to go on the castle. No chance. I remember you from last year. Cause chaos, you did. Come on, mister. We're only having fun. Yeah, well, there'll be no more of your kind of fun round here. I've changed the rules. Now the bouncy castle is only for children under the age of four. Ha-ha! <laughs> Fair enough. So yeah, you can have yeah. a go, then. As long as they don't have a brother called Dennis. You can't do that! <laughs> oh, yes, I can. My castle, my rules. Wunga and Bouncy Castle! Sorry, B. You heard what the man said. Come, Bouncy Castle. Hoppy do a poo! <laughs> hey, B, look. It's not my fault. You just can't! Hey, Charlie, fancy a cup of coffee? I don't mind if I do. Oh, 
Well, maybe you can. Must have been helium, like you put in balloons. Well, serves him right. He should have let you have a go, shouldn't he, B? B? Where is she? Uh, Dennis, you're not going to like this. What? What aren't I going to like? B? B flying! Ah! I know, Den. We could call in the Air Force. Send up a team of budgies? <laughs> no! I'll go up in a hang glider. <laughs> oh, I don't think so. Or we could send up the human cannonball. That's the daftest idea yet, Pie Face. It's miles too high. You couldn't shoot a person up there. You'd need something loads lighter, like... Like... <coughs> like a dog. <coughs> Go on, Nash. You can do it. <coughs> Go on, boy. For B. <coughs> Properly. We have fun with Den Den. fly up in air. <laughs> Did you? That's nice, darling. Well, Dennis, I'm so relaxed I've booked another class for next week. So I might want you to look after B again. That's all right, Mum. B's no trouble. Are you, B? Good girl. <laughs> Lovely, Dennis. Here. You and your friends go and enjoy yourselves. Wow! Thanks, Mum! <laughs> I'll take that. This little menace has ruined my lovely bouncy castle. Oh, Dennis! Think of this then, Nashie! Skateboarding without the effort! <laughs> OK, hold tight! <laughs> 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 Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> 
I found the ideal material for our new kitchen curtains. Look. Oh, yes. Very nice, dear. And it was the very last piece they had. It's perfect! I'll have my dream kitchen at last! Oh, you haven't got far with the painting, though, have you? I'm taking extra special care, dear. You can't rush a good job, you know. Hmm. All right. I'll go and look for curtain rails. Bye! Whatever you do, don't let anything happen to that material. <laughs> of course not, dear. I'll guard it with me life. Shame about the kite, Nasha. But it wasn't big enough anyway. <laughs> no. What we need is a big sail so we can go really fast. <laughs> <laughs> To make a sail for my skateboard. Got any ideas? Why, <sighs> what? Hey! Can I use that? Uh, yeah. Cool, thanks, Dad. Okay! So perfect, years, and now look at it, ruined! Um, I, I couldn't possibly have me sail back, could I? No, you can't. I'm confiscating it. It's a danger to public safety, and so are you! But you can't do that! It's not yours! Can't I? Watch me! No! Wait! Hello? Dennis, where are you? Are you bringing that material back? Yeah, I'll be right there, Dad. Just uh, um, having a chat with the Colonel. Oh, right, Nasha, this is getting serious. <laughs> well, might as well get some use out of it. I've always wanted a hammock. <laughs> Magnificent. That's well out of order. Right. Surely he doesn't think I'm going to fall for that old trick. So the little ruffian wants a battle of wits, does he? Well, he's going to find he's bitten off more than he can chew. Where 
Where's that boy? And take your rubbish with you! <laughs> right. The little pest thinks he's so clever. Let's see how he copes with this. Come and get it now, if you dare. <laughs> he hasn't reckoned with your mighty munch power, has he, Natcha? <laughs> and I know how to get there without him seeing us. <laughs> have to stay calm. <laughs> stay calm. <laughs> Breathe. Don't forget to breathe. <sighs> hmm. No sign of him. What's he up to, eh? We must be there. I can feel something. We'll have to get it out the way. Go on, Nasha. Do your stuff. <laughs> Son? Oh no, not that one. What? I changed my mind. I thought we'd have this one instead. What do you think? We deserve a rest after such a hard day's work. Avoiding homework. Time for homework handing. Any second now. Flea <laughs> 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 ridden hound. <laughs> Shoo! Avoiding chores. Dennis! Dennis! Your turn to mow the lawn! <laughs> And beating Walter to the last ice cream. Ice cream! Ice cream! Only one left! <laughs> <laughs> Turn! 
Look what my dad got us. Tickets to the premiere of Flat of the Palm 5 at the cinema tomorrow night. Starring Crank Power Up. Ha! 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 The greatest action hero of all time. Yeah, and even better, he's going to be there to meet his fans. Cool. I can't wait to show him his special move. Crank! <laughs> No, Dan. It's a can of giggles. Just arrived today at Mr. Ha Ha's. Fantastic! Careful, Dan. It's infectious. <laughs> nice one, Pie Face. I'm always up for a laugh. <laughs> but this is ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> Too much laughing. <laughs> Too much kung fu. Too much ice cream. Wash the car! <laughs> there you are. Come on, chores. Oh. <laughs> Ice cream! Only one left! <gasps> <gasps> Too slow, Dennis! <laughs> What's up, Dan? <gasps> oh, these hiccups are ruining me day! If I don't get rid of these hiccups... <gasps> I'll be so noisy, they won't let me in to see the movie tonight. <laughs> oh, no. Then you won't get to meet Crank Power Up. <laughs> exactly. Listen, I've got to sort this out. I'll see you later. So, what shall we do now? <sighs> we'll have to make our own fun. If I hold me breath, maybe I can hold back these hiccups. <gasps> Here goes. What's that racket? <laughs> Polish me kit bag. That's the worst case of whooping wallop I've ever heard. I know how to get rid of that. Tomato juice, a splash of <laughs> milk, spoonful of mustard topped with a... <laughs> Squeeze of sour lemon. Cross fingers that the Colonel's recipe works, B. <laughs> Disgusting. <laughs> Your aunties are visiting later and I've got to clean up. OK. I'll see if Mr Ha-Ha's <laughs> got any ideas. Seeing as it was his can of giggles that <laughs> caused the problem. I spy with my little eye something beginning with... G. <sighs> Grass. Again. <sighs> we could always get some more pies. That's no replacement for having Dennis around. <laughs> Why so miserable, boys? Having fun just isn't any fun without Dennis. And he's struck down with hiccups. Hiccups? No, oh, there's only one way to cure them. With a sudden fright. Mr Ha Ha? <gasps> Problem! <gasps> Can of giggles! <gasps> hiccups! 
Oh, dear. Did you open the can in a confined space? <laughs> There's your problem. <laughs> that's not hiccups. That's giggle-ups. You need this special supplement. <laughs> the Cano Giggles Guide to Curing Giggle-ups. <laughs> Cure number one. Balancing a pencil on your nose. Hmm. Surely that's too easy. Not when it's the Ha Ha Mega Jumbo Pencil. <laughs> Mr Ha Ha's right. This is pretty tricky. So, we sneak up behind Dennis with this balloon and kaboom. <laughs> what are you two up to? Oh, uh, what? nothing. Nothing. Cure number 23. Shout as loud as you possibly can. <laughs> oh, how would Krang Power Up do this? Krang! <laughs> For goodness sake, Dennis, go to the park where we can't hear you. All right, I will. I know and I'm not <coughs> wanted. <coughs> Looks like they're going to the park. Come on, I know a shortcut. <coughs> Here should be good enough. He's coming. Ready? <gasps> Nothing, no, just having a laugh. <laughs> just messing about, you know. Guys, I'm trying to cure me hiccups. <laughs> and you're not helping. <laughs> <laughs> well, this do for camouflage. Wow, pie face. How did you do that? My sister taught me crochet when I was little. Cure number 79. <laughs> Quick, get ready to ambush! Drinking water? There has to be more to it than that. <laughs> Next time. <laughs> Result! <laughs> you playing at? <laughs> it was your grand idea. She said a sudden fright would cure your hiccups. No good, guys. I'm fearless, remember? But these cures don't work either. They're <laughs> useless. <laughs> at this rate, I'll miss the <laughs> movie and I'll never get to show <laughs> Krang Power Up with special <laughs> move. Dennisy Wennessy. Our favourite little nephew. Oh. <laughs> 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 I knew what would give Dennis a real fright. Sloppy kisses from his loving aunties. <laughs> you were right, Gran. My hiccups have gone. I'm cured. Now I can go to the movie and meet Crank Power Up. In crunch of fists three, Mr. Power Up. What do you think? Very good, Dennis. Perhaps one day you will follow in my footsteps. <laughs> oh. Don't worry, I know just the thing. Hello, Auntie Beryl, could you and Auntie Brunella pop down to the cinema? I've got a bit of a problem here, and I think you're the ones who can sort it out for me. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>